After Health Canada sent out letters threatening medical cannabis dispensaries with RCMP raids, Vancouver police say they still won't enforce federal law. In a statement, Constable Brian Montague said the Vancouver Police Department's position on the marijuana stores has not changed. He added that the RCMP have the authority to enforce the criminal code anywhere in Canada, but I doubt they have the desire to spend time, money, and reallocate resources to a city policed by the VPD. In January, Chief Constable Adam Palmer said that he agrees with Conservative Health Minister Rona Ambrose that the cannabis shops are illegal but that he's always going to focus on the things that have to do with violence before the things that are non-violent. And right now, we're not seeing a lot of violence related to marijuana, but we are seeing violence related to harder drugs, he said. While the VPD has shut down dispensaries suspected of selling weed to minors or having links to organized crime, they've allowed the majority of stores to conduct business normally. With Vancouver's police and local government on the side of cannabis dispensaries, it'll be interesting to see how the feds deal with open pot shops come September 21st the deadline given to dispensaries. Unfortunately, stores outside of Vancouver don't have the same level of support and could be easy targets for the RCMP and local police departments. Still, it remains to be seen if Health Canada's threat is genuine or if it's merely more anti-cannabis government rhetoric.